Changes are coming. In fact, they're here. The real estate market of 2022 is no longer the absolutely <laughs> crazy dumpster fire that we've seen the last two years. The urgency is dying down a little bit and here are four signs that the market is shifting. As the market is shifting and truthfully has already shifted, I just wanna remind you that it's not time to panic. The headlines that are out there are meant to terrify you so that you click on people's articles. But let's look at the data and facts. The first sign that's coming up that is showing the shifting market is days on market. Now, days on market is sign goes in the ground to sell a house. How long does it take to A, get under contract and B, to sell? For the purposes of this, I'm gonna talk about how much time it takes to get a house under contract. In the last two years, it was less than three days on average to get a house pending and under contract. And if you were a buyer or seller, you knew that really the first 24 hours was pretty insane. But as this market is shifting, don't be surprised to see those days on market increase. In fact, as of the time of this video, the median time to contract for Alachua County is six days. That's almost a week. A year and a half ago, if a house sat on the market for a week, people would be wondering what the heck was wrong with it. So as we go into the shift, be prepared to see houses last on the market a week, two, maybe even three. And recall that that's still pretty short in the grand scheme of things. It just feels really long because it's not just hours. The second sign of the market shift is open house traffic. Gone are the days where you're going to have to wait in line behind 15 people to get into an open house. While traffic has still remained fairly steady in open houses, as inventory rises and this market begins to shift, you're gonna see more of a return to a normal, steady traffic of an open house. The third sign, no more offer deadlines. You may recall in the last couple of years that every time a house listed on the market, one of the first questions was always, when's the deadline to submit an offer? And I know for me, I used to list a property on a Thursday, create the buzz Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and collect offers Sunday evening to present Monday morning. And that just kind of became a standard, but that's kind of going away now. As a buyer, it's gonna give you a little bit of breathing room to maybe, I don't know, think about the house you're gonna buy for more than 20 minutes. And again, over these last two years, offers would come flooding in the moment that a house hit the market. But just remember, offer deadlines, they're not normal and they're going away. And the fourth sign of this shifting market that we're living in is price reductions. Price reductions were really not a thing over the last couple of years. And for sellers who still are not adjusting to this current market, they're gonna see price reductions. And I've seen properties have three, four, or even five reductions. Because what it used to be is you would price the house based on what it should sell for, you'd add a little bit, and then you'd tell buyers that's where they should start bidding. That's over. Gone are the days of getting 32 offers in 27 minutes. And as we return to this more normal market, if you don't make the adjustment and price appropriately, you're gonna have to make that adjustment later. So make sure you're really talking with your agent about the appropriate price because that wish list pie in the sky price, it's gone. And a shift like this can feel scary. And the most recent shift we all have in our minds is the big one from 2008. This is not that. This is just a market returning to normal. I liken it to being on the interstate. In 2020, we all started driving 95 miles an hour down the interstate and we were flying and things were going so fast. Well, in 2022, we've now shifted back to 70 miles an hour. It's still fast, it's still the speed limit, but boy does it feel a heck of a lot slower than what we're used to. So remember, it's normal, but it just feels really slow. Four signs our Gainesville market is shifting. Days on market, it's going up. Open house traffic is dropping down. Price reductions are gonna become more prevalent, especially as buyers have more choices on what to buy. And offer deadlines, they're going away. As this market begins to shift, just remember the interstate example that I gave you, we're slowing down to the normal speed. So put on your seatbelt, buckle up, 
And if you really wanna know what's happening with our local real estate market, do not miss my next market update because as a buyer or seller, if you're being indecisive, you're gonna miss out. I'm Lindsay Johnson, your resource for all things real estate. See you next time.